How does Kegel exercise influence women's sexual lives? Is there a connection between emotional intelligence and sexual satisfaction in women? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Kegel exercises can strengthen pelvic floor muscles in women, improving sexual health by enhancing sensation during sex and helping prevent issues like urinary incontinence. Yes, there is a connection between emotional intelligence and sexual satisfaction in women. The ability to understand and manage emotions can improve communication, intimacy, and sexual satisfaction in a relationship. Erectile dysfunction in women. While primarily associated with men, erectile dysfunction can also affect some women. This refers to difficulty in maintaining clitoral erection. Sexual therapy can be helpful in such cases. Diversity in sexual preferences. Sexual preferences vary widely among individuals. Some may be attracted to the same sex, opposite sex, or both, identifying as heterosexual, homosexual, bisexual, or pansexual. Sexual education. Today, sexual education has evolved to address topics such as sexual diversity, STI prevention, and the importance of consent. However, the quality of sexual education varies widely worldwide. The effect of light on arousal. Ambient light can influence sexual arousal. Some people may feel more comfortable and secure with dim lighting, while others prefer total darkness. The choice depends on individual preferences. Hormonal effect on desire, sex hormones, such as testosterone and estrogen, play a key role in sexual desire. Changes in hormonal levels can affect libido. Effects of pornography. The consumption of pornography can have varied effects on people. Some may find that it enhances their sex life and intimacy, while others may experience negative effects such as erectile dysfunction or relationship problems. The key is balance and moderation. Ejaculation. Time. The average duration of male ejaculation is about five seconds, but it can vary significantly from one man to another. Eroticism in literature, erotic literature, has been an integral part of writing throughout history. Famous authors like Anais Nin, Henry Miller, and E.L. James have contributed to this literary genre. Expressive eyes. Eyes are a central feature in attraction. Expressive eyes and good eye contact can be particularly attractive. Family care, interest and concern for family, and the ability to be a good parent can be very attractive. Clear head phenomenon. After orgasm, some people experience a sense of mental clarity, known as the clear head phenomenon. This may be due to the release of endorphins and stress relief. Fetishes are atypical sexual interests, including a wide range of objects, body parts, or situations. Fetishes are common and can be a healthy part of a person's sexual life if approached consensually and safely. Sex phobia. Genophobia is the extreme fear or aversion to sex. It can be debilitating and is often related to past traumatic experiences. Sexual therapy and counseling can be helpful in overcoming this phobia. Health effects. Female orgasms can have positive health effects, such as reducing stress, improving sleep, and relieving menstrual pain. They can also strengthen pelvic floor muscles. Hypersexuality is a condition in which a person experiences a significant increase in sexual desire. It can be debilitating and requires treatment if negatively affecting someone's life. The importance of touch, physical contact, such as hugs and massages, releases oxytocin, the love hormone, promoting emotional bonding and intimacy in relationships. The influence of music on arousal. Music can be a powerful aphrodisiac. Various musical styles and songs can influence mood and sexual arousal. Influence of smell on attraction. 
Smell plays a significant role in sexual attraction. Certain pheromones and body odors have been shown to influence attraction between individuals. Ancient sex toys. Sex toys are not a modern invention. Ancient artifacts resembling dildos have been found in different cultures, suggesting that people have been exploring sexual pleasure for centuries. Preference for long hair? Some research suggests that people often find individuals with long hair more attractive. This could be related to perceived health and fertility. Lubrication is essential. Since the anus doesn't naturally lubricate like the vagina, it's crucial to use lubricants to prevent friction and reduce the possibility of irritation. Masturbation in the elderly. Masturbation knows no age limit. Older individuals can also enjoy self-exploration and sexual satisfaction throughout their lives. The myth of the erogenous zone, the human body is full of erogenous zones, touch-sensitive areas that can be highly pleasurable when stimulated. These zones vary among individuals. Multiple orgasms. Some women can experience multiple orgasms in a single sexual session involving one orgasm after another without a refractory period, enabling continuous pleasure. Natural scents. A person's aroma, including their natural scent and chosen fragrances, can also influence attraction. Scent chemistry plays a role in physical attraction. Orgasm control. Some men practice orgasm control, also known as the edging method, which involves intentionally delaying orgasm to prolong sexual pleasure before allowing themselves to climax. Orgasmic dysfunction. The inability to reach orgasm, known as anorgasmia, can affect both men and women. This can be due to physical, emotional, or health-related factors and can be treated with the help of healthcare professionals. Oxytocin and emotional bonding. Oxytocin, known as the love hormone or cuddle hormone, is released during sex and orgasm. It plays a crucial role in the emotional bond between partners. Paraphilia refers to sexual attraction to unusual objects, situations, or activities. Examples include exhibitionism, voyeurism, and fetishism. Pararesis, also known as shy bladder syndrome, is a condition in which a person has difficulty urinating in public situations or with others present. It can be a challenge in shared bathrooms or relationships where intimacy is a factor. Pleasure without sex. It's possible to experience sexual pleasure without the need for sexual intercourse. Erogenous stimulation of other body parts, such as the neck, breasts, or thighs, can lead to orgasm in some individuals. Post-experience. After anal sex, some people may experience temporary sensitivity or discomfort. Resting and caring for the area can help alleviate any discomfort. Postures and positioning. Experimenting with different postures and positions can influence comfort and pleasure during anal sex. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.